Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to boot into safe mode on Windows 10 in three different ways. So it should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing I would suggest would be if you are booting up your computer, you want to start tapping the Shift and the F8 key on your keyboard at the same time as Windows is booting up. That should be the first method on how to boot into safe mode. Second option would be to open up the start menu on Windows 10, select the power button, so right where I'm circling my mouse, select that, and then hold down the shift key on your keyboard while left clicking on restart, and then it should say please wait, and then it will launch into the troubleshooting options that I'm going to go into after I show the third method in which we're actually going to boot in the safe mode. So third method here would be to type in msconfig, best match should come back with system configuration, you want to go ahead and left click on that. You want to select the boot tab and then select safe boot. Please know once you are ready to get out of safe mode you're going to have to come back into MS config and then uncheck this option and then underneath general you want to select normal startup but again if you're looking to boot in the safe mode here you're going to just go on the boot tab and then select safe boot. Select apply and OK. You may need to restart your computer to apply these changes so now we're going to restart into safe mode here. All three of these methods are going to take us to the same place, so that's just kind of why I chose to do the third method, was going to be the one that actually took us into safe mode here. But the other two methods should work fine as well. Personally, I use the one with the start menu and then holding them the shift and the restart key. That seems to work pretty well. And it's also pretty easy to visualize as well. It doesn't require going back in and making any changes to get out of safe mode once you're done. Unlike the third method that I showed because you actually do have to go back in and uncheck that option under the boot tab in the system configuration window. But I'll show you guys how to do that once again even though I already mentioned it. But we will show that in this tutorial as well. Okay, so now that we are in safe mode here, you can go ahead and do whatever you want. So the first two methods I explained did not require doing anything else to get out of safe mode other than restarting your computer. But if you did the third method, we're going to have to go back to the MS config here, select the system configuration from the best match. Make sure general startup selection said normal startup, load all the voice drivers and services, and the boot tab. You don't want to make sure safe boot is checked. You want to uncheck that option and then select apply and OK. You will need to restart your computer again, so select Restart, and it will boot your computer back into the normal Windows desktop. So, I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out, and as always, thank you for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial.